be making basics. What's going on YouTube? Beat Making Basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to my channel, please do me a favor. Go ahead and subscribe as well as give me a thumbs up because we're coming back to back with bangers. Now today, what I'm going to be covering is the quickest way to make your 808 glides in Logic Pro 10 using the step sequencer. All right. The quickest way to make 808 glides in Logic Pro 10 using the step sequencer. All right, so to demonstrate this, I have a simple pattern that I've started creating. I'm gonna let y'all hear that, and then we're gonna make an 808 pattern. And I'm gonna show you the quickest way to make the 808s glide using the step sequencer. So let's check this out. All right, so simple pattern going, you know, hats, clap. All right, simple. Um, but basically what I did here is I created a software instrument track and then I'm pulling up the uh, quick sampler came right here like that and I have an 808 uh, you know uh, loaded here one of my favorite 808s is from Bix Domain's kit right here I had that in there and so that's the 808 uh, simple to do an 808 pattern you can just go ahead and click in certain places All right, cool. So once you have a basic pattern in here, uh, what I would do is go over here to tie and you can make these notes a little longer. Then you can come over here and go to note and adjust the different notes. So maybe we might have a different note that goes um, at different places here. So we get basically we got a basic 808 pattern going and believe it or not the quickest way to make these 808 slide is actually to come over here to the quick sampler all right it has nothing really to do with the quick with the uh, step sequencer um but you're just going to come over here and you'll just uh turn the glide up right here right right where pitch is if you do that um you do have to create a software instrument i mean excuse me a um quick sampler track okay when you lay down you know your step sequencer pattern but that's the quickest way to actually make your 808s glide using the step sequencer I mean, you might be able to get a, like a, even a better view on it if we uh, push some of these things up an octave. So pretty simple tutorial. 
Um, appreciate y'all watching. If y'all have questions, let me know in the comment section below. Also, make sure you head over to my site, beatmakingbasics.com. We have courses there you can download. These courses have hours of content in them, and it's all structured. And once you download it off of the internet, you know what I'm saying, you can use these courses wherever, however, etc. You know what I'm saying? And we also have sample kits that you can get. Um, they have loops in them. We have drum sounds. Everything that you need to elevate your sound as a producer is right there on our site, BeatMakingBasis.com. Also, don't forget our giveaway. Um, you know, saying we got our first milestone coming up very soon, and we're going to be giving away a fresh, brand new pair of studio uh, headphones. Um, so make sure you head over to the site to find out more about that BeatMakingBasis.com. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see y'all in the next video. We're out.